40, 47. That's pretty badass. That increases the attack speed overall, which is good. Yeah, that'll uh, that'll do all right for us for now. My family came from there. That place has had some very bad. Let's look at some other craftable items here. Forty-one. Any forty-one stuff? The fact that I can craft Kane's memory is really good. Um. Because as a set, it's a fantastic item, but. equip that. I don't want to I don't want to have to rely on on green items here. Specific just because it's like once you start relying on them, I'm going to have to keep them for a long time. And like the benefits you'll get from equipping them long term is going to outweigh or is going to be outweighed by the fact that they don't. What's the word I'm looking for? They won't. They won't give me as good stats as just you know slowly upgrading between Listen rares over and over and over. This asshole. Emperor Hakam, forgive me for No, who the fuck else? The gods would have killed me had I sided with you, but I will help you now as I can. You must be headed to the oasis. I can open this gate for you. Yeah, you better do it, asshole, and get the fuck out. I don't want to see you. I don't like you. I like kids, but you're a shit kid. And I don't like shit kids. Shit kids are shit. Har, har, har. Yeah. Oh, wow. Well, that's increased my damage. What was my damage before I, I upgraded my weapon here? Probably not nearly as good. Man, the immediacy of the explosion here... I feel like it's outweighing the uh, effectiveness of the bolus shot here. Just because waiting around for that damage to start was getting so annoying. Hey, look. Elites. No, I will not do that. What do you mean? Do I only have two now? I might only have two now. What item did I equip or what skill did I change that removed one of my turrets? Hmm. That's interesting. Oh well, I'll probably never find out. Yeah, blow up. Eat my grenades. Bitch. Diablo was the youngest of the prime evils, but yeah. I found him the most dangerous. For this his feels good. This skill change after coming back feels pretty of good. Feeling fear. Though he had easily possessed and corrupted many humans, Diablo's essence was finally trapped in a soul stone. And now that's taking way to too much time. There we go. Twenty years ago. Literally burn all the bodies. Yeah, buddy. I need more hatred to do that. Arcane troubles. All right. We're actually doing okay. I felt like we were going to be doing worse at this point. We have battled countless creatures and journeyed through endless labyrinths, and yet you still remain vigilant. Oh, here we go. Now I finally have three again. I don't know if I actually did spawn in three last time and I just didn't see one of them or what was going on. Hey, we made it through the dungeon. We're the best. Around. Not really, though. Just kind of. I've never seen a place like No, I will not do that. I wonder at this point if replacing my turret with a 
companion? Is this no companion is under defensive here, isn't it? Nope. There's companion. Wow, this is a lot different from other classes I'm used to. What's after what's the skill after sentry? Vengeance. Turn into the physical embodiment of vengeance. That would be a very good skill, because that's basically a beast mode, which I use with and other Dario characters, the most notably the uh, the Archon she form the of the wizard is fucking badass and doubles its damage. Like, if you want to kill boss, if you want to kill a boss, you just go Archon and just go nuts, and the bosses can't do a fucking thing. Ultimately, she perished at the hands of brave heroes. <laughs> yeah, getting a grenade over there, that was funny. Maybe changing the run on the grenade. Because I'm not really running too low on uh, hatred here. So grenades, what do we have so far? We have cluster cluster grenades and we have grenade cash. Huh. That's interesting. So that spreads it out on a line. And what do the cluster grenades do? They're cluster grenades with larger explosions. Oh, it throw it's little explodey bomb thingies. That's pretty cool. Not enough hatred. It's a video game skill. I feel like that spreads out the damage over time a bit, too. But the, uh... Where is it? Where is it? What's the next one? Stun Grenade and then Cold Grenade. Those are good, but the Hatred one here was pretty important. What are the skills here? Drop a bomb when you black back flip. Increase damage of side bolts. Increase hatred generated instead of back flipping. So fire at three enemies and increase a ton of hatred. Uh, we'll go with that for a bit. I was liking the feel of that. I just wanted to see if there was anything better I could do in the meantime. This is pretty good. It does a faux Jesus. Come back into my safety sentries. Yeah, get out of your shit. Can't handle my vaults, son. Yeah, buddy. Oh, wow, another boss, or... What's the word? Not boss. I keep calling them bosses, but they are clearly not bosses. They're champions. They are champion enemies. The gold ones are champions. Oh, shit. Gotta get out of there. We gotta go fast. Oh, we did all right. What you got? Nothing good for me. Something for a wizard. Damn it. Ooh, experience pool. That's important. Oh, yeah. I like being able to throw out those sentries and just use them to cause... Serious annoyance. This is a fun character to play as. I feel like maybe I should have picked something with less of a glass jaw for my hardcore run, but that was supposed to be part of the challenge. Picking something that can die very easily if I'm not vigilant, basically. Kind of high stakes, high reward. High stakes. 
mistakes, High Reward? That's not the goddamn saying. That would not be wise. Yeah. Let's head up this way. What's in here? Flooded cave. I wonder what we got going on here. Probably just a random dungeon, but that's fine. Because we need to run through as much as possible just to get more experience. Because the higher we go in level, the less likely it is we are going to die. Then again, this game balances the game to whatever level you are and whatever your experience is so well. That I don't even know if it would actually matter long term. In fact, it genuinely might not matter long term. What do you keep going away to? Stupid ass rock worm. I need more hatred to do that. Man, we're out of hatred here. Not paying attention to my resources, that's a bad call. Yeah, you ain't shit now, are ya? Hey, welcome to the stream. Thanks for joining us. Doing a virgin hardcore run here. So, stay tuned to see if I die super hard. <laughs> I very well may. Not on these little guys, but we've run into some pretty hectic moments here. One, two, three. Caltrops, Caltrops, and rapid fire. Dodge away. Dodge away again. Oh shit. It froze me. But that means they're dead. Yay! We did it. Let's keep on keeping on. Yeah. Those rockworms are nothing more than an annoyance. I hate to say. Tech, well, technically free experience, it's still just kind of like dumb. It's like, oh, you're dumb. Why am I even bothering with you? I'm just going to keep popping up out of the ground like, Hi, guys. I'm stupid. <laughs> oh. This will be worth some experience here. Let's clear out the area. I will not do that. Yeah, buddy. The faster I clear these out, the more likely it is it'll spawn a chest for me. So it would behoove us to clear these out as quickly as possible. We have to get through five waves, basically. So the faster we get through five waves, the better. And the cooldown on this rain of arrows is actually fantastic. Because I haven't had, I haven't really had any issues with not having it when I want it or when I need it. Oh man! Hey, we did it. We're well on our way to another level here as well, which is badass. Fortune shrine. Man, I wish I'd grabbed that before I'd opened the chest. <laughs> seems a treacherous city. All the flavor text in this game is really cool. It's a cool way to keep you interested when you're just like, oh, I'm so sick of running through this dungeon. Makes you think about different stuff. As opposed to just thinking about the fact that you're running through another very similar cave to what you ran through, you know, 20 something minutes ago. We haven't run into anybody in a while. Here we go. Like, almost on cue the moment I say something, shit starts popping off. Although not much shit was popping off. Then again, we're on the second level here, so we're gonna run into, we're gonna run into an, at least one elite mob, and we're gonna run into 
uh, one champion. 